Hello guys, привет всем, здравствуйте, добро пожаловать. Today we're going to be watching Watchmen, as you guys were telling me that I should watch the director's cut. You know my love towards the short movies, so when I saw that this movie is over three hours, I got a little bit freaked out. But hopefully the movie is going to be interesting and three hours is gonna go unnoticed. But I doubt that because my butt is already getting numb. I looked at the poster and the movie looks like it's going to be about superheroes. But the poster looks very dark and the superheroes don't look friendly. But I like this idea, you know, because usually it's all about that shiny superheroes who could do anything. So we'll see what this movie is going to cover. I also on the poster, I saw a guy who looks like Batman, but he's not Batman. So is he like a copycat? I have so many questions towards the poster and it doesn't look... Uh, like a Marvel. It looks more like DC, but on the poster it didn't say anything, so maybe it's a completely different thing. I'm gonna keep my introduction short because you're gonna be here for the next <laughs> 10 hours. Oh, it is DC. Okay. Ooh. Good catch, Dash. <laughs> oh, as usual, the Soviet Union continued its military exercises. The United States does not start fights. The Soviets would never risk going to war. Agree to disagree. But does Dr. Manhattan's existence guarantee world peace? They feel threatened by Dr. Manhattan. Who is Dr. Manhattan? Unforgettable. Oh, wow, well, wow, well, that's nice, isn't it? Yeah, I wouldn't mind to have a house like that with a pool. And, you know, with a guy too. Oh, no, oh, okay. Oh, looks like the relaxation is over. Oh! Oh wow, they, they're good at fighting. Both of them. Okay, but the guy in BDSM suit definitely is bad at fighting. Oh! Oh wow, he has a lot of strength. Oh, he has, he has super abilities, right? Because you cannot throw a person like that. Like a big person. Oh! Oh! <laughs> it's a joke. Yeah. <laughs> oh! Oh no! The building is quite high, you know. Oh! Gaga over silk spectre. It shows different years, but the superheroes were always there, right? Because before it was like 1920s. Judging by the outfits. And this is a uh, World War II airplane. Oh, it's this famous picture, right? With a soldier kissing the nurse, right? This one. Okay, I love it. We created it. Happy retirement, Sally. Oh, because he's a crazy guy? The blue guy? Okay, that is a very sexy superhero outfit, let's be honest. Vietnam War escalates. Hmm? What is that? Pre-SR. Yeah, I saw snow immediately falls somewhere in Russia, you know? Oh... Oh right, he was he was superhero was there on the moon to take a picture. Who watches Watchers? Okay, now we're back to this guy being thrown away from the window. Edward Blake, 67 years old. See, he looked much younger. He was in terrific shape. You mean apart from being dead? Probably robbery. I made to look like one. Think Blake was a spook? Spook? This is way bigger than both of us. Is it normal thing flowing in the air? Dog carcass in alley this morning. The streets are extended gutters. Politicians will look up and shout, save us. A whisper, no. No? All those liberals, and all of a sudden nobody can think of anything to say. Okay, well, he likes this one, definitely. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. The comedian gets last minute man. A criminal always comes back to the... No, I definitely heard oh, okay. something. Okay, because I thought, you know, like, 
criminals always come back to a place of uh, murder. Mm. Okay, so he's a bad guy. He knocked him out, but he didn't kill him, so... It all started with the gangs. They thought it was funny. Dress up a poor heist. We'll finish what the law couldn't. <laughs> it was me, Dollar Bill, Mothman, and a comedian. No, don't get me started on him. You guys who picked up where we left off. Nixon, oh, that prick. That's almost midnight. <clears throat> Gotta go. You're a better night owl than I ever was, Danny boy. Rorschach has assaulted a police officer. Rorschach, it's like this thing that, um... Most everyone out except him. Oh, he'll quit. Rorschach is the thing that you show to people and you're like, what do you see on that? It's well, like his mask, right? You know... That's kind of cool. Uh, you ever miss it? No. Be seeing you. Nostalgia. So, before this guy was one of the superheroes, now he's fixing cars. It's like, they show... I love how they show different perspective, you know? It's always interesting to see a different point of view. Would you wanna come in? If you see stuff like that on your door, I would probably just bust, walk away. Hello, Daniel. Oh. Why didn't you knock? <laughs> you want me to heat those up for you? Fine like this. <laughs> Not PK either, I see. Daniel, look at this. He's dead. Let's talk downstairs. Let's talk in the creepy dark cellar. That could have been a burglary. Maybe someone's picking off costumed heroes. Comedian made a lot of enemies over the years, even among his friends. Nobody knows who you are. You can give it up. Rorschach's journal. Soon there will be war. Ha ha ha. Turning your superhero alter ego into a billion dollar industry. Oh, look at that. I'm not hearing a question, Mr. Roth. I'm sorry. Oh my goodness, he's so humble, I can't. If we make resources infinite, we make war obsolete. Thanks for your time. Okay, he seems so friendly, but I think he has something inside of him, you know, like something dark. Because he looks too good and friendly. It's been too long. Doomsday clock at five to midnight. Rorschach's a sociopath, Dan. I'm not here because I miss him. But I fear there's something much more real to worry about. If the Russians do launch their nukes, even Dr. Manhattan can't be everywhere at once. I want to know more about Dr. Manhattan. Rockefeller Military Research Center. The meeting with Dryberg left bad taste in mouth. Why are so few of us left active? The first silk specter is a bloated aging whore. Mothman's in an asylum in Maine. He's a good guy, I suppose. But he's so dark. Only two names remain on my list. Tell the indestructible man that someone plans to murder him. Dr. Manhattan. Oh, this is Dr. Manhattan? You shouldn't be here. You're a wanted man. Rorschach wants me to look into my future. My future is blocked. Caused by what? Nuclear holocaust. He's so ripped. I must return to my work. I'm not leaving. I think I did a good job looking him in the eyes, you know? Because, well, he's fully naked. Seems like there's a lot of things you don't tell me these days, John. How can you change the future? Dream! That is what I have before! Why don't you call your friend Eddie? Maybe he can give you a better life. Okay, superheroes also have all these home problems, you know? Say hello to Dan for me. You want to ask me to go to dinner with you, but you won't. You know I can't. She has feelings for the Dr. Manhattan, but if he's always naked, but you know, if you have a perfect body like that, probably you should always look naked. that crazy guy. He used to pretend he was a super villain just so he could get beat up. Whatever happened to him? Rorschach dropped him down an elevator shaft. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know Rorschach that well, but it does sound like him. Can't even tell if he actually cares about me anymore. You always get a government escort to dinner? Don't seem to be that many laughs around these days. The comedian's dead. Hello, darkness, my old friend. What does it say? And is night? 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 Oh, he's not naked. Is it comedian's funeral? Because he was working for the government. That's why he is buried as a soldier. Glory? 
hate it when John teleports me. Margarita? It's two o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, it's about time. I know why you're here. I can still read, you know. Eddie Blake's funeral is today. Poor Eddie. Poor Eddie after what he did to you? What happened happened 40 years ago. Oh, we have these flirtations going on, do we? You knew I was changing. I know what you need. I said no, Eddie. Oh, she's not into him. Come on, sweetheart. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sh <laughs> He's laughing. Are you serious? I can't watch it. Bastard. What a disgusting man he is. This will make you hot. What? <laughs> Terrible man. Things are tough all over. And he always thought he'd get the last laugh. No, I see him differently now. And I don't think he was the only woman that he did it to. People like that don't change. He seems to have the powers of a god, you know? If we lost here in Vietnam, I think it might have driven us crazy. But we did, thanks to you. The war is over now. We must talk. I'm gonna forget about you and your horrible, sweaty little piece of shit country. He is so mean to women. <laughs> oh! In my mind, he's a, just a horrible person. He al almost took advantage of one of a woman. He and just shot another down. one who is pregnant. Right. What the hell is that? You could have turned the gun into steam, but you didn't, did you? You really don't give a damn about human beings. God help us all. Can he bring her back? We'll be starting shortly. I told you you wouldn't be the only one dressed up. This is all bullshit. We can save this world. I mean, how do I do that? Smartest man on the planet. Mankind's been trying to kill each other off since the beginning of time. Once those nukes start flying, we'll all be dust. Oh, he's just minutes, burning sir. it? He smoked so much, it's surprising that cigars weren't, cigars weren't the thing that killed him. Cops say... And I couldn't finish. Badges, not masks. Oh, people are protesting against vigilantes. Do I want police to be... Doing the. Crawl back in your holes before you get hurt. Oh, he doesn't look like a stable guy. There is no need for violence. There is. Oh. Okay. To it's just like. Congress is pushing through some new bill. It's gonna outlaw masks. We're society's only protection from themselves. Oh. Okay. Well, we definitely see they have different. Views. What happened to the American dream? You're looking at it. This is dark as hell. Not only how their differences, right? But they still were close because we've been through a lot together. Totally nude girls? Totally. <laughs> Soviets will not tolerate US adventurism. I'm gonna read silent because I, I don't have enough time. Behind you! That girl, William Jacoby. I'm a retired businessman. I can hear his bones breaking. Heard you attended Blake's funeral. Why? Pay my respects to the comedian. How did you know he was the comedian? Why should he visit you? I don't know. I was crying. I thought he was gonna kill me. Yeah, well, that, that's the idea I would get. You know, I thought I knew how it was. I did bad things for women. Yeah, yeah. I never done anything like this. The truth is, you're the closest thing to a friend I got. What the f does that say? Mother, forgive me. And then he left. This is such a weird visit, though. <sighs> Sounds unbelievable. Probably true. <laughs> it's a leap. I have cancer. October 16th. Prostitutes? Could all be lies. But if it's true... <laughs> She is a very angry prostitute. Humans are savage in nature. Blake saw society's true face. Yeah, fingers like licking a battery. Oh wow, oh wow, well that is pretty cool, I would say. What are you doing? I, I always thought you liked this. No. I don't know, looks like she was enjoying it. Are you working in here while we're in bed together? 
Okay, I can see why she's upset. And but there's still someone still left in there. If you think there's a problem with my attitude, I am prepared to discuss it. What am I to you? You're my only remaining link to the world. I don't want that responsibility anymore. It's probably not easy to date a god. Right, because he is busy. But the girl just wants to be loved. So can you judge her? Dr. Manhattan will answer my question. It's Lori. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. I didn't know where else to go. I love the love cult so much. I left John. I don't know why I'm here. I just, I don't know anybody else. He looks at things now. It's like he doesn't remember what they are. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> This is twice now I've ruined her evening. No, I think he's pretty happy with her being there. Oh. Oh. <laughs> that blue is too light for television. Is that dark enough? No makeup needed. This month's issue still hasn't arrived yet. Honors like your hawks. He was at the funeral too. Here's a list of Pentagon approved no go areas. The world knows him as Dr. Manhattan. That's a lot of them. Do you agree that we're that close to annihilation? Clock is as nourishing to the intellect as a photograph of oxygen to a drowning man. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh! We showed it in details. I can only see my own past. Do you remember a man named Wally Weaver? He died of cancer. And what about General Anthony Randolph? Cancer. <laughs> oh, well. Your ex-girlfriend? She was a physicist too. She has cancer as well. You are the world to me, John. Do you remember how many times you said you loved me? Jenny. Wait. He still cares about her. Is it because of a radiation? He teleported them back home? Or he just what did he do? Well, he just broke up with his girlfriend. The other girlfriend claims that he gave cancer to her, so it's been hard of harsh day on him. You know what? I'm wiped. <laughs> I think I've had enough hero stuff for one night. Well, that's how you Take deal with down. depression, right? You just talk and kill 15 guys. Dr. Van Hatt just lost her on live TV. Leave me alone! Well, it doesn't look like Earth. It's July 1959. Sean, I wish she gave us a little notice. Years later, he still has this picture. She is a physicist, like me. She should really change. We were introduced by a good friend of mine. It's mm -hmm. February 12th, 1981. Wally dies of cancer. Jenny's gonna die as well. I think I left my watch inside. He was normal. Why is he all blue now? The program's locked in. Oh no, sh I'm sorry, John. Don't leave me! When I'm introduced to Janie, she buys me a beer. Our fingers touch. Oh, it's the way to man's heart, you know, buy him a cold beer and it's like... Oh. I feel fear for the last time. Oh, what the hell? What the hell? He just disappears? It's the only photograph of me anyone has. A partially muscled skeleton stands in the hallway. That's interesting. I honestly did not expect that he was... Um, like an ordinary man, you know? And that all of that made him to be like this. I thought that he was always like this. The Superman exists, and he is American. <laughs> and he is American. They call me Dr. Manhattan. The marketing boys say I need a logo. Oh, it's going to be like an eye. It shall be one I respect. They are shaping me into something gaudy. Oh. Nixon asks me to intervene in Vietnam. Some of the Viet Cong forces want to surrender to me personally. God exists, and he's American. It is Christmas, 1963. I tell her I don't think there is a God. But they stick together, you know, even after the accident. I am in a room full of people wearing disguises. She's beautiful. Oh, so he left Jenny. Jenny accuses me of chasing jail bait. She's aging more noticeably every day. What? That's, that's harsh. While I am standing still, I am tired of Earth. He cheated on Jenny, right? And he is. But she said that she's getting older. And he's like, yeah. <laughs> so, but I would say it's not easy to date someone like that. It goes both ways. Perhaps the world is not made. A clock without a craftsman. But how cool that you actually Too can... Late. 
go on another planet and just sit there chill, you know, while you're tired of everyone. Did you and Dr. Manhattan have a fight today? Oh! This is close to the word whore as you're gonna get with me, Agent Ford. Smoke. <laughs> okay, let's be a gentleman now. But I can see why Dr. Manhattan does not really put relationship into his priority. You're pretty cool in there. You got her eyes, you know. Take your hands off her. Are there no depths you won't sink to? What the hell do you think I am? Oh, we found him! Well, we saw a few scenes. Mars. Oh, he went on Mars! Like, I'm too tired of that book. Move their tanks just short of the Afghan border. They'll probably start with airstrikes. I say when Doomsday is approaching. What about the rest of the Warsaw Pact country? They're playing a wait and see. What would our losses be? We'll lose all of the East Coast. Not so bad? Not so bad? Well, we, we have a different perspective on not so bad. Begin fueling the bombers. Humanity is in the hands of a higher authority than mine. Clearly, if he's on Mars, he doesn't want to be reached. She <laughs> changed him. The only thing that can bring John back is John. Without Dr. Manhattan around to bully the Russians into peace. You cannot bully someone into peace? The world can't just quit on oil. And why free energy? Free is just another word for socialist. I respect your position. You want to know my past? Hmm? <laughs> no one, no one said yes, though. So. Both my parents were dead. I've always been alone. Being unable to relate to anyone. The only person with whom I felt any kinship, what? Alexander the Great, as you know him. I resolved to apply antiquity's teachings to our world. He doesn't seem like a person the who world can be bossed around. I buy and sell you three times over. I think you know the way out. He's smart. He doesn't have ready to show it. Seems all the old villains are dead. I think I have some ideas. Oh shit. <laughs> Don't bite down, you son of a bitch. Who sent you? Oh, oh, oh. The guy was dead before he hit the ground. But who would want to kill us now? No word from John? No. Why don't you come stay with me? Oh, hmm. I wouldn't have to worry about you being out there. No, oh, it's very sweet. Okay. Maybe, maybe there is something going on between them. Do you think so? They didn't know me without my mask. Does Manhattan even have a heart to break? I abandoned my disguise. Became myself. Heard woman scream. He's not running to help. <clears throat> oh, the he's. Turned. Okay. It was a local lowlife named Roy Chess. He worked at Pyramid Transnational. Happy Harry's Bar and Grill. I love how he, you know, looked around. It's like, okay, yeah, no one's watching. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna jump, you know? I'm not gonna knock. Someone tried to shoot the world's smartest man today, Moloch. Last time I was here, I saw a pension check written from the same company. Oh! Run pyramid. <gasps> oh, sh oh, sh oh, no, no, no. Oh, well, he is not a killer then. Don't forget to check out my Patreon for these exclusives. And now back to movie. We know you're in there. Wait, frame no. him. Wait, no. frame him. Are you serious? No, 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 no. Please, no. wait, frame him. So someone thought that we're not going to be able to get Roshak, but we would be able to frame him. Oh! Oh no! Oh, that must have been so painful. Well, everything here seems painful. But you know what I like is that the second that he takes off a mask, no one knows it's him. So technically, even if he's in deep, he still can live normal life. The question is, does he want to? Off. Identified as Walter Kovacs, a 35-year-old white male. You're responsible for a lot of them being in prison here. Tell me what you see. A pretty butterfly. I, I saw panda. <laughs> oh, this one I see as a spider. Like a huge spider, you know? You keep calling me Walter. I don't like you. <laughs> I don't like you. I'll tell you about Russia. We don't do this thing. Thing. We do it because we have to. He's I was investigating a kidnap case. I was young then. I let them live. I'm not gonna like what I see, will I? And then I found her. Oh, sh Holy! Oh my! Who, does, who would do that? People like us do just. I cannot believe there are such monsters, monsters, you know? I'm not going to be crying over his death. Who is it? How 
okay. I confess. Arrest me. No, you wish you'd get arrested. No, don't. Don't do that. Oh. Whatever was left of Walter Kovacs died that night. God doesn't make the world this way. We do. I like the way how he thinks. Hey, you're pretty famous, right? I'm pretty famous too. Oh my god! That's the, that's the oil! That's the hot oil! I'm not locked in here with you. You're locked in here with me! Oh sh! It's not like you stuck here with me. No, not. <laughs> I messed it up. It's not that I'm stuck here with you. You stuck here with me. Love that. Oh! I remember that from early in the movie. Oh, she's gonna drive it? Oh, fire alarm? <laughs> well, it was worth it. Or oh, maybe not. Are you hurt? No, no. I drive for Ford and all this stuff anyway. Well, my dad was in corporate banking. I think he was disappointed that I went into crime fighting. <laughs> well, I can see. It must be nice having a secret identity. Nobody watching you. Okay, I think we're definitely going to end up together. They amplify the spectral range. They work even better in the dark. You can see me, right? Oh, wow. This must be the way John sees the world. Oh, well. Back back to the ex-conversation. <laughs> Made it awkward. Like, I'm leaving. John sees a lot of things, but he doesn't see me. <clears throat> I love how much he tried to say something, but just, oh, so hot, so turned on that, no, he couldn't, but it was, oh, oh. <laughs> yeah, I just need a couple minutes. That's okay. Is he thinking that because she was sleeping with God, now he's not really gonna no, impress time. her? He only has two hands. A long time, Rorschach. How long now, Lloyd? Almost 15 years, Mr. Figure. He has a cigar in prison? That guy you burned is dying. They're all dying to get a piece of you. Tall order. I'm gonna oh. turn this guy a new hole soon. Well, I know that he can take care of himself, but if there are that many crazy people, crazy criminals who would want to kill him... A uh, hot? <laughs> but... Oh, that's the dream. That was his dream. Oh, wow. And let Google, you know, kissing the girl at the world end. What does it mean? <laughs> I'm tired of being afraid. So to hell with it. Let's take Archie out. I'm used to going out at three in the morning and doing something stupid. <laughs> Who doesn't? Isn't? Who isn't? What about her latex costume? Oh, yes. There you go. You know, when you can't sleep, that's what you do. Oh, we have a police, police, um, sequence. Oh, it's water? Okay, well, that's a good plan. Probably once you get all this adrenaline, you can just go back to normal. Is that Jesus? No, baby. You know, they are superheroes, but they definitely look and act like normal people, you know? That's the satisfaction. World War Three could start tomorrow. Of course, I gotta have sex now. I don't think it is a sexier moment. Oh, it's gonna happen simultaneously. Oh, this is the burnt guy. This is a chaos. Oh! He's dead, Rorschach. Oh! I'm sorry, Lawrence, but you're in the way of my revenge. <gasps> This is, this is just, what the hell? This whole cancer thing with John, it just doesn't make sense. Oh no! <laughs> okay, well, not so, not so bossy now, are you? This movie is very violent, holy sh... They seriously just showing how... Wait, cut the arms of a person because he stands in their way. He just don't, doesn't want to participate in all the, all the chaos. Where's my face? 
What do you see? <laughs> this is- I love this moment too. I think this is hot because it turns both of them on. Doing all of that in heels with her, her hair down. Impressive. Excuse me. Have to visit men's room. Oh, oh, I see. Okay, okay. Well, unfinished business, is it? Is it are you serious? You know? We came here to rescue you and you are in the washroom. Should have known all you needed was a nice pair of legs to motivate you. Oh. <laughs> well, true, though. You just get tired of being patriotic or someone puts you up to it. I had to turn the screechers off, so we'll be drawing fire soon. Oh, it's a bulletproof, too. What a night. Are you all right? You just di didn't want to be call called out. War, jailbreak. Everything's going to be fine. You're going to try to convince me to save the world. Lori, don't. Dan, I have to go. Okay, that's, that's hard to be her new boyfriend if her old one can do all of that, you know? I'm on Mars. Some super owl dude just busted Rorschach out of prison. Maybe he messed your cousin up too. Oh, okay. All this time you've had my number and you wait until our sunset years to use it? It was a tenement fire last night. My daughter, Lori? <laughs> You're sounding younger than ever. Oh. oh my god, he's so flirtatious. Don't get too misty-eyed thinking about old times. It's the owl! You there? Shit. Oh no! Oh no! He's gonna lose. But you know what? All this pisses me off when 10 guys attack one man. Unless you want to go back to prison, we'd be stupid to expose ourselves without a plan. Well, prison looks very escapable to me now. It's a friend company for whoever's running behind it, but can't prove it. You are a good friend. And still, you know, people know his face now, but he still prefers the mask. It's difficult with me sometimes. He gets sentimental? Let's do it your way. They're in the transnational. Back off, bro. Stick this glass in your squidgy face. Are you serious? Go, come on, do not fret that guys who look like that. Roy Chess. I, I hired him, I knew him from the inside. Well, by whom? My contact. Miss Slater. Said hiring ex cons are part of the company program. Give people a second chance. Get people a second chance. She was really nice. Well, nice lady. Mm -hmm. Jenny Slater. Wallace makes a sound murder in his apartment less than an hour ago. This is gonna break their hearts. They were very close. Who did it? I have never seen him like that. Tell your friends, they're dead! In front of the civilians. You know about me and Dan? But in a few moments you're going to tell me. You cannot trick him. Why even argue about it if you already know how this is gonna end? Everything is preordained, even my responses. The most powerful thing in the universe is still just a puppet. I'm just a puppet who can see the strings. Why would I save a world I no longer have any stake in? When you left me, I left Earth. My red world here means more to me than your blue one. When you left me, I left Earth. But I can see if he was telling her that that's the only link that he has and now that... She Mom decided to leave him. Ready, sir. Why save it? It's time, gentlemen. I'm gonna look for Adrian's itinerary. Maybe he keeps on file. Jenny Slater, Moloch, Roy Chess, all work for Pyramid. Whoever owns Pyramid could be giving these people cancer. Ancient pharaohs looked forward to the end of the world. Oh, it is Dr. Manhattan. Okay. Okay. I'm in. Wow. Well, what are the chances that you would have a book with uh, your password on the table? That, that's bad. Oh, we are in loss. Look at that. Wait, international. Congratulations, Mr. White. Your support. Ooh, White. <gasps> oh, I read it wrong. Miss Lucci. <laughs> a shame that you must now share such an adequate reward. Sleep well, gentlemen. What is that animal? Final entry. Final entry. Fights behind everything. He could kill us both alone in the snow. I hope the world survives long enough for this journal to reach you. Can't you just tell me Final how Final entry. And save us the trouble. I love the narration a lot. 
You have to stop this. The existence of life is a highly overrated phenomenon. Mars gets along perfectly well without so much as a microorganism. You try to have a breakup conversation with a guy and he just keeps talking about the universe. Yet you continuously refuse to see things from my perspective. Go ahead, show me. I was our hero, guys. Why is it we keep coming back to this conversation? Oh, your mom, she was one of the all-time champion mules. Drive. She's still afraid of him, she hates him to the guts. Years later you let him finish the job? What? Were you drunk? Finish the job? Where's your father? Are you serious? That's a, a revelation that you don't expect to find out on Mars. Everything is crashing. My life is just one big joke. Will you smile if I admit I was wrong? About what? Miracles. Millions upon millions of cells compete to create life. Your mother loves a man. She has every reason to hate you that emerged. She's a miracle. It's like turning air into gold. A miracle. Well, it looks like his perspective changed a bit, but you know, seeing your a girl you love is a miracle. It's kind of cool. Now dry your eyes. And let's go home. Okay, now, so because of her, he's actually gonna save Earth. The engines. Not bad. Not bad. You need something warmer. Fine, like this. Mr. Dr. Manhattan, old friends, I couldn't have guessed that White would be behind the whole operation. Because there was a tap on him as well, wasn't there? Oh, he listens to Russian news station. He's stronger than they are. Gentlemen, <laughs> welcome. Welcome. Gentlemen. You killed comedian. May he rest in peace. Nixon had him keeping tabs on us. They found out what I was doing. Even I couldn't predict he'd be the one to have a change of heart. Oh. Oh, well, okay. I put roughly two billion dollars into Tachyon research to block John's vision. Are you serious? All I needed to do was tug on the thread. When he came to believe he'd given cancer to the people he loved. Yes. This is diabolical. I put a cyanide capsule in his mouth. And once you're in prison, I was able to move forward. Okay, that's diabolical, right? And especially those are being his friends, right? And he just betrays them like that? Those are the closest people to him. And while the safeguards gave me pause as a necessary sacrifice, 15 million people killed by Dr. Manhattan. John wouldn't do that. In fact, no one outside this room ever has to know. John was helping me replicate his power. Unaware of how I planned to use it. In order to save this planet, I had to trick it. Killing millions. To save... Billions. This is just... No. I triggered it 35 minutes ago. Are you serious? That's why he's in Arctica somewhere? Doomsday is here. Oh! I love that. That's a cool moment. What do you see? Where is Dr. Manhattan? Why the hell didn't we get a large detection? It's not a Soviet, Dr. Manhattan. Oh, sh... Can he turn the time back? This wasn't caused by nuclear warheads. It was me. What do you mean you did this? I made to look like I did it. Mm-hmm. Adrian. Who is gonna believe? Speak of the devil. <laughs> Where did he go? He ran away? Even if I can't predict where you are, I can turn the walls to glass. I'd almost forgotten the excitement of not knowing. That's a very cool pet. Forgive me, girl. Oh, he's gonna kill the pet as well! My name is Osmandes, King of Kings. You're such an asshole. He did really kill Dr. Manhattan? Oh, he can catch bullets, right? He's faster than a bullet itself or something. You bastard! If you've hurt her, I'll... Then, schoolboy heroics are redundant. 
Failing to prevent Earth's salvation. I'm disappointed in you, Adrian. Oh, Doctor Doctor Manhattan? Yes, he's alive! Because I thought, wow, it would be too easy on a death for him. But they used his energy, so I thought it's pr totally possible. Reassembling myself was the first trick I learned. Did you really think it would kill me? I have witnessed and so tiny and so fast. We're just a man. What's that? Billions of lives were suddenly ended. Oh, ultimate weapon, yes. In constant contact with the premier of the USSR. We are both pledged to unite. We will prevail. This is a day we shall never forget. God bless us all. Two superpowers retreating from war. This is as much your victory as it is mine. Yeah, but by killing how many? Now we can return. Everyone's gonna know what you've done. You would sacrifice the peace so many died for today. I don't agree with that, but I see his idea. You taught me the value of life. We must remain silent. So he agrees to take the blame for killing millions of people? Don't even think about it. Never compromise. It's always been the difference between us, Daniel. But it's already... What can he do? Made myself feel every day, every innocent face I have murdered to save humanity. Understand, don't you? I understand. Okay, he is taking. What? What? He has to make a piece of a shock first. Suddenly, you discover humanity. I'm being scared from the start. I can change almost anything, but I can't change human nature. Because she must protect by its new utopia. One more body, one foundation. What are you waiting for? He will. Oh! They do not value friendship at all in this movie, you know? We just betray each other. Well, I know that this is oh, in, in the Rorschach shape. I know this is not a betrayal, but still, we are all friends, aren't they? I thought you said you cared about life again. I think maybe I'll create some. Maybe I'll create some? Oh, we all know what it means. There had to be sacrificed. No. I'm still surprised that they let Dr. Manhattan to take all the blame. So alone. You are about to participate in a great adventure. Okay. I know that Eddie Blake was my father. I'm sorry I never told you. Oh, stupid. It doesn't matter. I just want you to know that you never did anything wrong by me. Well, this is mature. This is a very mature conversation. Why I wasn't mad at him? Because he gave me you. Thanks, Mom. Aww. I love it. I love that. Not mad, not screaming, no nothing. And she was so afraid of this conversation. But, hey. Gotta go freshen up. I'll be right back. She's a fox. All of Archie's systems are upgraded. So all we gotta do is take her out. They seem happy. Are we gonna be alright? Ish. <sighs> Nothing ever ends. Or well, everything always ends. Are they restructuring now? Or oh, it says friendship. USA and free SR friendship. In your heart, you know it's right. Comedian. Ugh. Ketchup? Yes. We got nothing to write about anymore. Ronald Reagan says he's going to be running for president in 88. Who wants a cowboy in the White House? I could look for something in the crank file. Run whatever you like. Leave it entirely in your hands. So, what does he like? <gasps> oh, Rorschach's journal. Rorschach's journal. Holy. October 12th. This is a very interesting outtake on superheroes. Right? Because uh, superheroes can also be villains. But the whole idea about this movie, you know, the bad guy won. But at the same time, he did a good thing. You know, I cannot say that he did a good thing because what he did was terrible. But what if, uh, like, this is the moral dilemma of all times, right? Would you kill few people in order to save many? So I'm not going to be able to answer that one. But... I see why he did that, because he thought that there is no better solution. Like, uh, he didn't kill these people just to kill these people, he killed these people to save many more. So, it's not that he did a villain thing in his mind, right? In his mind, he is actually a superhero who saved many millions, billions of people, right? So, it's very hard to judge. And the whole movie had this, like, gray area, right? But 
I loved that they didn't show superheroes to have this all shiny, bright life, you know. I love how in the beginning they showed that someone of some of them actually went crazy, but others were killed, and that there is so much on going on, and that people are against you, right? Because we were saying that bring the cops, we don't want the masks, right? We don't need these vigilantes, we just want sick police to protect us. I would say that this movie shows that superheroes also have a hard life. And because it was made in DC style, right? Everything was dark. It was, I don't think we ever saw afternoon in the movie. It always was raining. It always was night. And also they did show a lot of bones breaking, blood, you know, all of that. Arms uh, cutting. Oh, like they did not spare any details about dying here. And that was that was a little bit gruesome, but at the same time, it added this, um, like the whole movie was made in these dark tones, right? So adding all of that actually might actually made sense at the time of watching. So interesting, interesting. Plus, I learned about new superheroes because I never heard about any of them ever, and. I liked it. I liked it. If you want to see my full length reaction video, follow my Patreon. Link is on the video and it's also in the description. Also, please don't forget to subscribe, press like, and let me know what you think about my reaction. I also want to say thank you to my patrons and I want to have a special shout out to the following patrons. Tom Castro, Martin Bench, Jimmy H, Matthew Paul, RGW, Robert Borman, and Brian Rollins. Thank you guys so much and I'll see you soon. Bye.